Oh, what is up? And welcome back to my channel. Show me to the left. Anyways, if you're new here, make sure you subscribe to the channel. Make sure you thumbs up this video and make sure you're following me on all my social media sites at Shandera. With that being said, today is officially the unseen sunscreen all day wear test. I am so excited to officially put this sunscreen to the test. I know, I know summer is coming to an end. For Pete's sakes, you guys, I've seen Halloween pumpkins already out and Costco got Halloween candy. But I say, you know what? I've been promising and promising to get this sunscreen out. Today, we are going to the lake and I will be wearing the sunscreen all day. So I'm really excited to try it with you guys. So I am going to go ahead and do my skin care routine with you for the lake uh, because you know you may have a makeup routine but this is a skincare channel so I do have a skincare routine so I cleanse my face with uh, Trader Joe's uh, face wash I really like that it has tea tree oil in it I've been breaking out you guys know y'all have seen breakouts all over my face so I really wanted something that will soothe my face and Trader Joe's tea tree face wash does it dries out the face but it does soothe it some people don't like to dry out your face I really don't mind create a canvas which is your face to apply more oils and serums to your face so I don't really mind drying my face out every now and then with that being said I am going to be going in with Kudalese Beauty elixir so this is the limited edition one I went ahead and got it y'all so we're just gonna apply this this is just to tone my face you guys know I love this so much I use it literally <laughs> I use it like it is not $50 and I was actually shocked that I was actually gonna like the Kudalese Beauty Elixir but I love it. Now I am going to be adding Kudalese Vino uh, Perfect uh, Serum. This is a rant uh, radiant serum for complexion correcting you guys know if you've seen under my chin I have a lot of dark spots so I'm really trying to correct my complexion I think I've probably damaged uh, my skin just a little bit this summertime because you guys know I've been trying to go on a diet and I'm trying but hunty no more Popeye's chicken for me <laughs> no more Popeye's Chick-fil-A I'm saying bye to you I am not gonna eat out no more you know I look at my old videos and I'm like girl what happened you were so skinny after you got pregnant you just gave up and side note I was on fentanyl when I was giving birth so I didn't realize fentanyl was a serious drug and it could literally like break down your body so I was on fentanyl and I was on an epidural and I didn't realize that that stuff breaks down your body and I'm still feeling the effects and Sonomi is about to be too real soon well next year but you know you know how these babies they grow fast y'all so now we are going to be going in with um what is this i forgot it's coles uh it's coles rx i hope i'm saying it right this is a comfort uh cream this gives you a matte feeling and makes your skin look great and glowy so i really love this cream so i know i seen this funny pinterest video where <laughs> They were like, oh, uh, put this much on. But I am going to put this much on for the lake. You guys, I hope you stuck to this whole video to see us go to the lake. I'm sorry if I'm talking so much. But you know, I'm trying to make this quick. I am going quick. I'm going quick as possible. So I will be using Super Glue's Unseen Scrum Sunscreen. I am so excited to do an all day wear test. Many of you have been asking for it. So this is how much I will be applying of the sunscreen. Uh, yeah, so let's just talk about this sunscreen. I know I was mentioning talking about it, but then I started rambling because this is like a get ready with me slash lake slash everything visit. So are so funny as humans. And I just want to say this before I head to the lake because Josh is going to kill me because I'm like, the only one not ready but anyways this is so funny you guys humans are so funny okay we are funny as humans you guys are really downing manual exfoliations right but when it comes to uh chemical sunscreens you guys want nothing to do with it but chemical exfoliation is okay and physical sunscreens are okay but no chemical sunscreen and no physical exfoliation so i'm just saying how funny we are and how just twisted as a society we are no need for a physical exfoliation it will cause micro tears chemical 
chemical sunscreens will damage your skin. No, don't put them on. Do a physical sunscreen. I don't see nothing wrong with it. I'm a type of person. You choose what you want to choose. If you like a physical exfoliation, choose a physical or manual exfoliation. If you like chemical exfoliation, choose a chemical exfoliation. If you like physical sunscreen, choose physical sunscreen. If you like chemical sunscreens, choose chemical sunscreens. I am a Libra. I like to balance both. You guys, so we're headed off to the lake. My unseen sunscreen is officially on my face. So this is what my face looks like. Uh, no makeup, just bare naked face. <laughs> oh my God, I hope you guys can see. So anyways, it's gonna be an all day wear test so we can see what the super gloop is about and I know it's a chemical sunscreen so we're gonna see if it burns or whatever. Hey you guys, so it's really sprinkling when I decided to go to the lake so I don't know how this all day wear test is going to go. Um, yeah, it's rainy. I was expecting it to be a little dry, nice, sunny, clear day but there's a lot of rain. So I guess we can test if the sunscreen is waterproof but I will say there's no white cast so it is looking really good on my skin. However, it is raining so I'm just gonna show you guys like the rain. <laughs> As you can see, it's like overcast today. It was sunny, like the sun is that way over there in that area. But yeah, you guys. So yeah. And I actually wanted Sonomi to actually play in the lake, but my whole idea just went downhill. Nothing ever works out, you guys. I just don't understand it. But uh, I'm gonna be a trooper and hopefully eventually it would clear out and we could have a sunny day testing this sunscreen. Let's pray for a miracle. You guys, my child is such a water child. It's like 80 degrees out. She's at the water play. It's hilarious, look at her. Oh my God. <laughs> She's already wet. Uh, such a water child. No, she's not. Put her back in. I guess she get excited. No, You're she's right. Now. No, she's not. Put her back in. Let her get in. <laughs> oh my gosh, she is so naughty. <laughs> oh my gosh, she she can't swim here she goes she thinks she can swim okay you guys so the sun has officially came out just a little bit it's like peekaboo so i'm so excited to like text this sunscreen so so far with the sun being out now my skin feels good i haven't had any allergic reactions yet to the sunscreen so i am excited about that uh yeah and also i want to say there's no zinc taste so i'm starting to like chemical sunscreens i don't know about you guys but i like the fact that it doesn't have that metallic taste that normal sunscreens have and you know since it's been raining we could see today is it actually waterproof so i am excited about that also if there's anything in my teeth i was eating popcorn so if you see anything i'm sorry so yeah Okay, you guys, so we're officially done at the lake. I'm like stepping on rocks and trying to talk to you guys at the same time, praying I don't fall. Uh, so it's getting a little dark. I will say the sun did come out a little bit. I have tested the sunscreen a lot. So I think this all day wear test wasn't a bust. It was a positive. So I am gonna give this sunscreen the benefit of the doubt for the all day wear test. With that being said, you guys, we're gonna have a full conversation 
when I get back on the sunscreen. So I'll see you guys in a bit. Hey you guys, so we're finished with the lake and my all day wear test is officially complete. I know the lake was looking a little shaky, but hey, I did what I could do. And I've been testing this sunscreen over the months because I wanted to come back to you guys with a full review. And I thought the all day wear test would be good content for you guys to enjoy as we talk about the sunscreen. Cause you know, I just can't send in a chair all day and talk to you like this with that being said let me start rambling and get into the details of this sunscreen i did use this as i was riding my bike i did use this when i was going to the track you guys know i am trying to lose the baby weight two years after the fact but she's not two years but a year and a half after the fact so when i did use this sunscreen i noticed that it's not like a physical sunscreens it won't get in your eyes it doesn't have that chemical or that metallic taste to it certain sunscreens I do use tend to, when I'm sweating tend to get in my eyes and will burn my eyes this one didn't do that it doesn't carry a smell it's like something you won't notice you're wearing all day so I'm really happy they came up with the sunscreen that's just like putting on a moisturizer you won't know you're wearing it all day uh, it's just wonderful to finally leave the house with the sunscreen that I don't have to say uh, that doesn't taste like metallic that when I sweat it's not getting in my eyes it's not leaving this greasy film all over my clothes it didn't do that for me as well as being able to just have a great day without my pores clogging it goes on smooth and I don't have to go and wash up so you guys i ride my bike and of course i was going to the track because you know i'm on a budget i'm not paying for a gym with that being said when i do these uh the cardio activities um i don't have to go right after and take a shower with normal sunscreens i tend to have to take a shower right after i go from get home i do it normally but sometimes you know you want to cook dinner first you want to get your daughter all settled down before you actually go and take a shower and sit down and eat dinner so instead of taking the shower right away i'm able to sit down and do things run errands and just you know don't have to worry about oh what is that taste oh my eyes oh it's just sweating everywhere and it was actually nice to actually go into the store without people looking at you like why why you look white like you look like dracula what's going on <laughs> so it was just nice to be able to just have a sunscreen that was just normal <laughs> If that makes sense. No, it was normal, but just something where you're not looking like the crazy girl in the room. And you know, Arizona is not like LA, and I compare it to LA because I am from LA. So, you know, in living in LA, everything is just normal. You can go in the store with different color hair. You can be gothic and go in the store, you know, and just be weird. Like, it's, being weird is normal in LA, but being in Arizona, it's just a different ball game because people are transplants from every state and they're not used to certain things so you know me going to the store and looking like you know <laughs> just weirded out so it's really a great feeling for people to not ask are you okay or is something wrong with you finally for the first time <laughs> so i'm just happy about that it actually goes on velvety nice and smooth i'm telling you it's like you're not wearing sunscreen at all there's no metallic taste it's just a really great sunscreen it's easy to wash off your hands and once you decide to take a shower and remove the sunscreen it's, it comes off easy. It comes off right away. You will not have no issues. And I'm also excited that it did not dry my skin out. It could have been because I did my three-step or four-step skincare routine as well. But even when I didn't do it and I would just put the sunscreen on when I was working out, it didn't dry my skin out after I washed the sunscreen off of my face. So that was a bonus for me as well. So I do want to talk about the sunscreen for other people. If you have very oily skin, do be wary. This sunscreen is pretty thick. It does have silicones in it. Some people are still on the type of train that all silicones are bad. So if you are that type of person who you really don't enjoy silicones because they clog your pores, you may have an issue with this sunscreen. 
sunscreen and may clog your pores especially if you have oily skin you may get some sort of breakout so I do want to mention that for people who have very oily skin or if you have combination skin like me leaning on oily then this will break you out I have combination skin leaning on dry now that I live in the desert when I was in LA it was a little bit oily here dry is all outdoors with that being said you know make sure you're a little rary get you a sample first to try it I'm actually going to go ahead and give this Shondera's stamp of approval I'm sorry it took me so long to do this video I know a lot of y'all been waiting for it my bad thank you super glue for making a sunscreen for women of all skin tones I don't care if you're fair skin pale olive skin brown skin chestnut honey you know all colors of skin tones in the beautiful rainbow the blacker the berry the sweeter the juice if you're that type of chick who's very dark skin whatever type of skin you have I don't care I need you guys to always remember skin is skin no matter the color no matter the skin tone you know there could be a very fair fair skin lady who has the same type of skin that a dark skin lady has so no matter what skin is skin so I'm really happy that unseen sunscreen or super gloop the company came up with a sunscreen that is perfect for women of all skin tones I know there are fair skin women out there who don't like white cast uh, sunscreens because they're fair skin and they're very pale it makes them look like a ghost and I'm happy super glue came up with this as well as for us dark skinned women or brown skinned women out there you know it's dark skinned women you know how we look with sunscreen all over <laughs> our prime example honey my dark self go in the, go in the store <laughs> looking crazy so I'm just so happy they made a sunscreen for women of all skin tones who are able to finally look normal at the grocery store so thank you so much super glue for making it easier for women of all skin tones all colors for us to take care of our skin because at the end of the day that's all we want to do is protect our skin from skin cancer protect our skin from the sun so we don't get dark spots so we don't get hyperpigmentation no matter what your skin tone is you are liable to get hyperpigmentation I don't care how fair you are I don't care how dark you are you will get hyperpigmentation if you're in the sun for too long it's possible so thank you so much super glue for that and you know I have to tell Josh you know I tell this story all the time but I'm about to tell it and then I'm gonna go Josh did not listen to me for the first few months he came to Arizona or it was weeks I don't know and he started getting liver warts y'all all over himself looking like freckles I said I told you I said you think I think it's really an American thing because when you go to other countries the in deserts they're literally draped up in full clothing to protect themselves from the sun but for some odd reason here in the desert Americans think it's weird to be clothed uh, when the sun is out I don't understand Americans here in the desert y'all are weird I'm American too but y'all really weird anyways with that being said I told him to clothe himself he started getting those liver roars then he seen one of his foremen at his job had one that was the size of a like a quarter or a nip. it was really big it was looking like a mole and the guy told him he has to get it checked for like um, skin cancer and stuff like that. I guess Josh finally got the memo and started wearing long sleeve, sleeve clothes. With that being said, please protect your skin no matter what climate you live in. And I want to thank you guys so much for watching this video. Thank you guys so much for subscribing to my channel. Make sure you subscribe to the channel. Make sure you check out SavvyNaturalista.com for all your skincare needs. Make sure you follow me on all my social media sites. And I'll see you guys in our next video. I love you so much. Bye, you guys.